friends, I am super hyper mega giga excited. Oh my god. Okay, listen, 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 listen. I have the Avatar The Last Airbender subscription box. Not sponsored, not affiliated. Let's call this video Jackie geeking out for, I don't know, X amount of minutes. For those of you who don't know Avatar The Last Airbender, please go and watch it. Even if you've given it a try when you were younger, because it is an old show, and you're like, eh, I don't like it, it hits different as an adult or as an older teen. Trust me, it hits really, really different. The feels. Don't watch Korra. Don't watch the Avatar The Last Airbender movie. I'm talking Avatar The Last Airbender show. It's basically the story about this kid who's in the air nomads, who's supposed to be the avatar so he can master all four elements. However, having all this responsibility was really hard on him because he had to bring peace to the entire world. So it's basically his journey about relearning how to take on that kind of responsibility, but make friends along the way. Let me know what kind of fandom you get any kind of subscription boxes for, or if not fandom, what kind of subscription boxes do you prefer? By the way, if you're new here, this is my second channel, Nerdy Jackie, not to be confused with Nerdy Crafter. And I kid you not, I've got this box because of TikTok as I was browsing because I can't sleep sometimes at two in the morning. Someone's like, look, I got the subscription box from Avatar The Last Avenger. I'm like, what? What did you say? What did you say? So then, surely enough, I went on the Nickelodeon website and found that it is a limited edition, four boxes, I think four boxes only? Probably. You'll see on the screen. And it's basically one for each nation. Water, earth, fire, and wind, I believe. I don't know if there's more. I think that's it. I could be wrong. But you know what? I'm gonna keep getting. So even though I did miss the first one, I'm super excited to go through this one with you. Without further delay, let's... Let's do the open it. Actually, you know what I realized? You're gonna see this now. It's in my background. That's how much I love this series. I actually bought the entire Blu-ray collection, which I normally don't do. I'm like, I don't need material things more than I already do. But however, this series definitely inspired me. So I don't want to ruin the box. So I'm gonna be gentle with my sharp pointy thing. All right. Oh my God, even just the box. So this one here is supposed to be the Earth Nation. First one we missed was the Water Nation. Now I keep forgetting if it's called the Earth Nation Water Tribe. It is the Water Tribe. This is the Earth Nation bossing say I believe. So I have really big hopes for this one. I know the water one, there was a lot of cool things but some things I didn't like so I'll definitely let you know which I like and which I don't. Oh my god. <gasps> oh, oh. <laughs> No! We get an Appa plushie? Now, I'm surprised, I'll be very honest, honest, <laughs> very honest, I'm surprised to see this in the Earth Nation because this is a flying bison and it's supposed to belong to the Air Nation? Air Nomads, sorry, I keep mixing it up. It's a baby! <laughs> And this plushie is super soft. It is absolutely adorable. The face is kind of derpy, but it is very cute. This is going in my background, the details of the arrow. It is soft. Without a doubt, you can tell this is good quality, but also look at this. This is official merch, the tag. Holy moly, this is official merch. I'm not removing this. I love this little baby. I feel it's, it's out of... It feels out of place though, interestingly enough. Oh, we do have the card. It says, The Last Airbender. Oh, 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 we don't, we're, no, 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 no. We, we not looking at spoilers. Oh no, we not looking at spoilers. <laughs> okay, we have, oh, we have a bobblehead pen? Really? Okay, so here we have a character, his name is King Boomy. Oh, that is cute. Let's put things aside here. I'm getting a little distracted, if you can't tell. <laughs> Let's bring you a little lower and a little closer. So this is a nice quality kind of vinyl. There you go, acrylic vinyl. A little bit of a bobblehead. This character kind of surrounds himself with stone. So this is what it's supposed to represent. And then we have the different characters from the show. Interesting. But this is definitely the emblem and kind of like the symbol of the Earth 
kingdom. Oh, there you go. The earth kingdom. Oh, okay. Let's test the, let's, let's test out the pen, shall we? Apparently this is my test pad for all kinds of writing. What are you, blue or black now? Oh, juicy. Oh, that is juicy. I like you a lot. That is nice. Okay, so we have that. Very useful. I love things that are absolutely useful. I like a mixture of cool things, but also a mixture of useful things, not just decorative. I have no idea what you are. This is the Team Azula Fire Nation. This is weird. This is weird. Why do we have fire and air mixed in with earth? Now, I don't know if I misread, the description but I was pretty sure this would be the earth kingdom the earth nation kingdom this is a nice booklet though so we have like this fake leather strap goes all the way around and is this a journal oh okay we have May are the changes oh I was gonna say are the changes different but it's are the pages different and yes this is a nice little notebook I love the tan color of the paper. It's kind of like a peachy, salmon-y hue. And again, this fake leather. I'm just surprised that it's not earth. We're getting a bunch of different elements in here. I'm not complaining still. I love all the other <laughs> elements. So it was a surprise to me because the previous one really was just water tribe stuff. Look at that, even the detail in here that is beautiful that is beautiful even if you're not into the show you have to appreciate the details and this is i kind of saw it oh my gosh oh my gosh i kind of saw it because you know of the card it was like the biggest thing that stood out but we have a tumbler i believe oh my gosh cut just open <laughs> We have an Uncle Iroh. He is everybody's favorite character. He's basically your wise uncle, the Jasmine Dragon, yes. And what kind of, oh, is there supposed to be a straw? Okay, there's no straw in here, but I love cups that have straws. <gasps> That's perfect. Usually my sippy cup is actually also with a straw. So you can see that we have basically Uncle Iroh, the Jasmine Dragon, and we have Zuko on the other side. No way. That is fun. I love my water cups because I leave them in different rooms of the house, but now I can have dedicated ones in different rooms. It is standard, pretty plastic. Are you machine washable? Usually they're not. Hand wash only. There you go, and do not microwave. So it's very standard kind of tumbler. Oh no, I dropped it! Oh no! Is it still okay? Please be okay. Oh gosh. Oh no. There's a smidgen of a scratch. It's not a crack, but I scratched it. Oh no. I am such a klutz. As long as it's not cracked, we're okay. We're okay. Okay, I'm not gonna put this on the corner of the table anymore. Jackie, you cannot be trusted. You cannot be trusted. We're gonna put you over here. There. All right, the next thing is a t-shirt. Are you a t-shirt or a long sleeve? Because we are getting into the warm season. Oh, this is actually a long sleeve. Interesting. I did not expect this to be a long sleeve considering the fact that we are getting into warmer weather, but it's definitely really cute merch. Very minimalistic and you have to know Avatar in order to appreciate it. The material feels really cool though. I like that. Oh, and uh, here's our straw. <laughs> We have our straw with a, with a stopper so that it doesn't fall right out. Jackie cannot be trusted. So basically, this goes like a saw, and this is the stopper. So it doesn't fall out. There you go. Now put this somewhere safe, Jackie. <laughs> Over there. Let's see what else we got. Oh, we have a decorative scroll. Probably one of the characters, if I have to guess, the character that is the most iconic with the Earth Nation probably is Toph, who is a pretty badass character. She can't see, so she's blind, but she kicks ass. Yes! Oh, Toph! Oh, that is a beautiful scroll, down to the detail of the wood. And it says Earth, and it has Toph on there. And the fact that it is a scroll doesn't have those weird bends or turns or anything like that. That is pretty awesome. I think I'm gonna try and have it as a background in my gaming channel 
If you're interested in my gaming channel, I'll leave the information down below. It is Raging Raccoon Gaming. Join me, we do have live streams on there. Okay, let's see what else we get. This is, oh, okay. The sticker of, I guess, the maker. Next, what do we have? Oh, what are you? Is that a magnet? Are you a magnet? No way. Four nations map with magnets. Okay, that is cool. That is definitely going on my fridge. So you can see all the different kinds of nations there are. And you can see the characters. Let's unpack this. Let us open this properly. Oh, goodness. Because this is definitely going on my fridge. <laughs> okay. All right, so here is the map. This is the Earth Kingdom. Here we have the Fire Nation, which is basically trying to take over the entire world. Who are you? Oh, we have Appa, so the character that you just saw, with a couple of the main characters. It's gonna stick them somewhere over here. It's probably gonna stick better on the fridge. I don't know if the magnet holds on to the magnet, but I mean, it's doing a fine job for now. Oh, there's one here. <laughs> We have the main characters. We're still missing Toph. Where is Toph? We have the Bad, Bad Dudettes. And then over here, there you go. There is my girl. She's so sarcastic and so sassy. It's hard not to love her. <laughs> Oh, I do want to mention, though, that they did send the wrong t-shirt size. So this would be way too fitted. So I asked for a larger size, but they sent me medium. So I'm probably going to message them and let them know what's up with that. So hopefully they can send me the real one that I did order. Oh, Dan, Dai Li agent shirt. There you go. And here's everything that I got in this box. I'm trying to remember how much I paid. I know I paid, okay, I paid $143.96 for four boxes. So divided by four, this much per box. Hey, I'm gonna do the math. So it's about $36 per box. For $36 and you're getting official merch from a show that is really hard to find merch of, I have to say, for me, as a fan, <laughs> this is definitely worth it. Again, official merch. I'm not complaining. Thank you for watching me geek out. And uh, if you want to watch more videos, make sure you check up here. And if you want to check out my gaming channel called Raging Raccoon, make sure you check down here. Until then, I will see you grains in the next video.